Welcome to the channel, my name's Dave. Uh, welcome to part two of the workshop update. Um, basically just still at it, working my way through things. Uh, the biggest thing with this is trying to get the tools you use most often out where you can find them easily and where you're most likely to use them. Uh, this is a process you, you're going to chop and change things. Which is part of the reason I went for the pegboard because it can be changed easily, uh, multiple different hook designs and so forth. Um, I've already had a lot of these tools behind me up and down about ten times, but you get that. Uh, it's all about optimization. Um, I'll also give you a bit of a rundown of some other issues I'm having, um, and give you a bit of a tour of the shed. All right, hope you enjoy. Cheers. One of the issues I've been having, all of my spanners here on the wall, or the vast majority of them, have been in a ammo box for the last probably 18 months uh, because I ran out of draw space. Also, a lot of these tools on the wall have been taking up draw space um, and really crammed in there, which makes life rather difficult when you're trying to find things. Now all of this stuff I can see, I can easily access. I can actually use my whiteboard without trying to do the hokey pokey. And yeah, you know, there's a lot of tools here that I'd forgotten I even had. Uh, you know, even taking up little spaces like up in here, just to get a few things out of the way, keep them safe. That cabinet has got to go. I don't like having things in here that aren't on wheels. The whole idea of my setup is that any of this stuff can be moved around the shed anywhere I like, uh, giving me other options on where to work and how to work. Sorry about the camera angle. You know, you're hanging off an engine crane just to get the, get the shot. It's about my only option right now. So, one of the biggest problems I've found is drawers. You put something in there, you know it's in there, you go, and go to find it, and you can't. Even those shallow drawers can be a real pain. I don't have any sorters in there. Um, and it's like a workspace. You find you put things down and forget about them. So it's just a junk accumulator. That's why I've gone for the pegboard. Uh, it keeps everything on the wall where I can find it. And it's adjustable, infinite, infinitely adjustable. Some stuff does have to go into drawers. Uh, you don't have much option, but you just end up with stuff everywhere. And you, know, you get a drawer like this where there's a whole heap of tools in it, but you know where they are. Are you sure it's in that drawer? Yeah. It's part and parcel of, of trying to work in a small environment and not having money to just go out and buy stuff to make it all line up beautifully. Uh, this is a real shit. Ooh. And things like that happen. 